Yes, hello everyone. Welcome again to this channel. I want to say thank you so much because of your great support and also your continuity to support the analysis of this channel. I'm so much grateful and I'm so much humbled for what you are doing to support this channel. Now, Kipchumba Murkomen, who is the senator of uh, El Geo Marakwet in Rift Valley region, is sending a panic message to Kenya Kwanza Alliance at large. Ali, Kipchumba Murkumen was spotted, but I think this was just a, a slip of a tongue, which according to me, Kipchumba Murkumen did not intend to say that they are, they are going to vote for Raila Amolo Dinga. This was just a slip of tongue. But now Kenyans, Kipchumba Murkomen with his statement, is coming out to show panic on their side after Raila Muru Dinga had settled on Martha Karua as his running mate. That is number one. Number two, Kipchumba Murkomen is claiming that the most thing that is going to destroy their support in Mount Kenya region is that this political party called the UDA party, there are certain leadership in Mount Kenya region that are campaigning with their local languages, spreading bad news that this UDA political party is for Kalenjin and it belongs to William Samoy Ruto. That these leaders are continuing to spread that message to ensure that as a mule team are going to get a sympathy votes. Because when it comes to Azimio, they have given these local political parties to fill their candidates, be it in Jubilee, be it in Na Kenya, be it even other political parties that is uh, in Azimio, but they are in Mount Kenya region they have been given an opportunity to give their aspirants a mandate to carry the flag of their political parties. So whatever Kipchumba Murkomen is coming up with is that they must be very careful when it comes to also treating these political parties that are in Kenya Kwanza Alliance. If it is UDA party, let UDA party give chance to other political parties to fill candidates across the Mount Kenya region. Because if this is going to continue, they might lose it big. And this is the reason that Kipchuma Murkomen is coming out with in his uh, interview. That if UDA party is going, for example, let's give a Kiamba constitu constituency, that UDA party is going to give a uh, aspirant a ticket to run with that ticket as a member of parliament in Kiamba, then TSP, then Chama Chakazi, then Tujibebe Wote Party, four political parties or three political parties to give a candidate opportunity to carry the flag of UDA party and other political party. It is likely to Azimura Omoja to win because they might give one candidate with one political party. If it is UDA, no, if it is Jubilee party, that uh, Azimula Moja is going to support one candidate in one political party, if they decided that Jubilee party is going to fill the candidate in Kiamba. So it is likely according to Chumba Mokome, that they might lose several seats across the Mount Kenya region and also across the Republic of Kenya, which it is endangering their winning when it comes to the presidential election. Because 
these voters who are going to vote for certain leaders, they might be affected with that leader that they are going to elect. If it is as, as mu they might vote for Raila Moludinga and Martha Karua, where after losing those seats, is going to affect their candidature as Kenya Kwanza Alliance. So Kenyans, I think Kipchumba Murkomen is coming on a right way. That when it comes to their planning and political uh, politics in Kenya Kwanza Alliance, they must be very careful with the politics the way they plan themselves. Because the main issue that these alliances are looking for is that are they going to have several members of parliament, senators, MCAs, women rep, and governors. So I think this is going to be so much more important. And that is why Kipchumba Murkomen is like panicking and afraid of losing certain seats in Mount Kenya region. And after that, because of Mount Kenya region, they're looking for great support and massive support, they might lose it. So Kenyans, what are your, are your thoughts? You can drop your opinion at the comment section below. Are you supporting the statement of Kipchumba Murkomen or you, you, uh, it is just okay the way Kenya Kwanzaa is uh, controlling their politics? You can drop your opinion at the comment section below. Otherwise, I want to thank you so much because of your great support. If you're a visitor, ensure that you subscribe. You put on the notification bell that when I upload my videos, you get notified. For those who are returning subscribers, thank you so much. God bless you. Till we meet on another, another video. Bye-bye.